Hello to all Riverline students and welcome to the 2020-2021 academic year. My name is Adenuga Tewalogun and I'm the president of Riverline Community College. I can't tell you how excited we all are to see your faces back on our Riverline campuses in Albert Lee, Austin and Owatana. Our vision is to offer the best opportunity to you and every enrolled student so that you can attain your academic and career goals in this ever-changing world safely. We start this year with some extra challenges as we continue to battle the pandemic, but with extra precautions and the full cooperation of each and every one of you, we think our planning over the last four months should keep you safe. Before coming to campus, consider some precautions that will keep you and your fellow students safer once you get here. If you spend time with others, you should make sure it is outside, limit groups to one or two people, and keep six foot distance between yourself and others. Always wear a mask if you can't social distance. We know it's a challenge, but avoid visiting bars going to social gatherings or any other situation that will put you at risk of contracting COVID-19. Once you get on campus, we'll need you to adhere to certain guidelines. Remember, our ultimate goal is to reduce transmission. Riverland is following the guidance of Minnesota Department of Health, the Center for Disease Control and state officials, and we support social distancing as much as possible, as well as masking, Ultimately, it's these two efforts that will prevent spread of, on campus. Those strategies, combined with proper hygiene, hand washing, and reporting symptoms are key to safely navigating our college's safety protocols. Riverland is requiring a self-assessment for all students, employees, and visitors that enter our buildings every day you come to campus. You can scan the QR code at all entrances to get the screening tool, or you can visit riverland.edu slash screen to access the online form. It will ask you a few simple questions. Once completed, you get a green checkbox if you can come to campus. Remember, if you aren't feeling well, stay home and call your academic advisor and your instructors. If you have symptoms, call your healthcare provider or local public health agency for more direction. At each of our campus buildings, there are only a few open entrances. Check the Riverland website's COVID-19 page for open doors on your campus. You will show your device with your green check mark to the kiosk worker, and they will give you a sticker to wear so you come and go for that day without stopping at the kiosk each time. Again, remember to social distance Wear your mask and wash your hands often. Hand sanitizer will be available in some areas where hand washing might be a challenge. Your campus and classrooms will look a little different too. There is less furniture and chairs and properly spaced to encourage social distancing at all times. We wanted to remove the temptations for you to congregate with others without distancing. Your classrooms will have sitting properly spaced apart so everyone will be safe. Please don't push furniture together even if you are wearing masks and avoid sharing space under six feet with others for longer than a few minutes. Although we can eliminate all risks to you, we can work together to do our best to keep everyone as safe as possible. We realize that all this will take a little getting used to. But if each of us follows these steps diligently, we'll keep everyone safe. After a few days, we'll get better at it, and then you can concentrate on the real reason you are here, to attain your academic and career goals. I wish you luck in your classes this fall, and stay safe and keep learning. We can get through this together. 